Hey, good morning. Welcome to another video here on the Ember Family Entertaining. Uh, real quick, I want you guys to make sure that you subscribe to this uh, channel and also uh, be sure to hit the notification bell. To, uh, we'll let you know when we actually post new videos. Uh, straight to the point, I just want to ask you guys a question and leave a comment below and let me know what you guys think about it. What if you go to your bank and you go through drive through and to make a withdrawal and you give the proper uh, credentials that you uh, need to verify your account information and you give them the deposits uh, the withdrawal slip you put the correct uh, account number on your uh, withdrawal slip uh, but just to be clear, all everything that you gave to the teller matched up with your account. You did all of that just to have uh, your uh, or the teller or the manager of the of the teller of the bank uh, come to the window while you know other people coming through drive through to ask you where did you get your money from where did you get this kind of money from where did it come from i would like for you guys to answer that question for me okay um to i guess the you know and possibly the manager wasn't thinking about privacy act at that point because at that point to ask anybody about where you get your money from or where this money come from over a, t a drive through intercom is already violation of privacy act so but anyway i want you guys to uh just kind of tell me what you guys think about that give me leave me your comment below um because it was very disturbing also not to mention uh before asking that question uh you know how about if they the manager leans over and look at you um possibly looking at who you are in which at that point it enters a uh, profiling uh status and then proceed with asking you that question. So let me know what you guys think about that. Uh, and leave me a comment below. And we'll go from there. All right. Appreciate you guys, man. You guys have a blessed day.